Hi everyone, I'm Mary, and today we're going to be watching more of the Undertale fan animations because I had the brilliant idea last time to watch all of them in one go! <laughs> oh yeah, that, um... That was impossible. If it sounds like I'm hyped, it's because I am. I know, crazy, me, hyped. Never done that before. More importantly, there's going to be a link to the playlist down below. I've got so many recommendations lately that it's absolutely overwhelming. I'm just going to finish this one and see what I can pull up next and... Maybe play the game, see what happens. You guys know the deal, though. Again, link below, original playlist that I'm using, and we'll just get started. All right, first up, we have Fishy Love. I'm going to have to censor this, won't I? Oh, no. A tribute to the cutest... No. Gayest? Okay, yeah. Why isn't it the cutest, though? Ooh, Gale Rice. Cute little image. Oh, yeah, that's the cutest part, yeah. Okay, it's voiced. And like all things, I have no idea if this will be claimed by YouTube or not, but who cares? It's fun. Is this a real song or something? Did she just- I'm sorry, did she actually make fan art of Undine? She did! And it's completely in the B Shoujo style. Oh my god, the super sharp chin, that's what does it there. Also, way more hair. Admittedly, damn. She actually does really well in that- even though she has too many eyes? Eh, uh, details. Also, if, if anyone happens to know chemistry, what is this that they put up there? Is it random chemicals? Or is this some kind of joke I'm just not good enough at math to realize? Dopamine, serotonin, oxycot- Aren't those all the happy drugs? Oh, 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 I see. She's literally formulaically showing love, isn't she? Oh my god. They even put the hearts in her eyes? I didn't even notice because he had the other drops there. No, no, they have the hearts. It's just the usual reflection. What's the fishy part? Because Undine's fish, She's yeah. I'm, to I'm sorry. Uh, base status? Hot. She's, I don't even... Who comes up with this? I don't even... She's so determined. Yep. What if she finds out I'm lying? Oh, it's the human version. Sorry, I was like, wait, that's not. But then, no, 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 human skin. Okay. Wow, that's. I don't know why I'm going on this, but for some reason, the ascot makes me think. Was it Cyborg 009? I haven't seen that one in ages, but for some reason, yeah, the hairstyle on the ascot make me think that. Also, it might be her hair choice here. Yep. Really classic choice to inspire this big. Nice. What if she sends oh yeah, definitely away. Cyborg Zero Nine. I, I know those hair swirls anywhere. And she's a scientist, so it would fit. What? Oh, is this some of the other art this person's done? Probably, yeah. Oh my God. Was it really this? Oh, that was the game. Oh, they actually have the two-parter and she heard it. Sorry, I want to see this point again right here. Just that moment of realizing she heard it. Oh, okay. In terms of art, it's like the, I'm happy to see you, but also I want to die. And she's singing into a hairbrush. Oh my God. I love that little part right there. It just shows that everything was in her head and how much of it was. And it's not even pointed out. Just that's a, such a little nice technique they added there. Loud, <laughs> Oh, with this much music, there's no way in hell I'm allowed to use this in on my just like in YouTube in general. I'm still watching though, because this is good. Embarrassment, yep. Did, did he just randomly... Oh, sh Did he uh, Did he just third wheel them? He did, but she didn't get it. How? It randomly just ended? No. Oh. Kind of surprised. And there's a lot of human versions of her art, aren't there? Huh. Smush together like a bug. I got a case of fish in love. 
third wheel, man. Next up, we have Undertale Shorts Asriel. If he's actually going by his name, is this probably from the end of the game? Ooh, that might be cool. Oh, I've been told this guy's uh, Gaster. Whoa, okay, I recognize that animation for the final boss. I don't know that one. I know that's fully, but I don't know what's going on there. I... Uh, Sans with his coat open. I haven't usually seen that one very much. I only recognize one of these, and he say it's time? Ah, the branches of time, of reality. So many iterations of the exact same event. Oh, yeah, because I've seen a few of these animations. This one here, I know. And if he's talking about time iterations, oh, is this one of those overall metaverse ones? I've heard that's a massive thing and is a metaverse into a metaverse of a metaverse for an overall universe. That shouldn't make sense what I just said, but I think it's accurately describing everything I've found out about this so far. With so many ways it can unfold. Is that a duck? That's a duck. Parallel universes are Okay, what the hell? I thought that was the one animation I saw, but no, that, that's a giant duck fighting sands. I... I've missed things, apparently. This is very interesting. That's a word for it. I was going to say weird. Would you agree? Ooh. Ooh, he looked right at the screen. Love that touch. Oh, NHC Productions, of course. They've done a few others I've seen. I think they were actually the one I saw previously about Asriel's transformation. Or no, Flowey's transformation. What? Is that for a mother tale or a mother? I don't actually know. Askar! Askar, can you hear me? Oh. Yes, Elvis. What's happening? I'm dying. The Royal Guards. They're all dead. Oh. And the souls. The facility has been breached. Genocide run? What? I actually don't know where they are now. Wait. Oh, so this is a completely different timeline altogether, not just animation from the game. Oh. Because if it's not the human, then it's something else? Timeline where Flowey won? You mean there is another? Yes. They were wearing a green striped shirt. Or it's just the other one. Okay, so it's... I think it's char... Whoa! Okay, that's an animation change! Whoa. Okay, what the hell? I was going to say this is comic book-esque, and I'm going to stand by that because the way the shading is done by different levels of cross-stitching or cross-thatching. I'm not actually sure what that technique is called to show the shadow level rather than just ambient light effects, which they've done over here as well on top of the, I'm going to say, thatching. Dude. Even if it's a 3D model behind it, it actually gives it a comic vibe. Oh, I've never seen that used this way. and That's so cool. Also, I'm assuming because it's the human with someone who I'm assuming is Azrael, this is... It's like they went on a genocide, no, not even a genocide run because they didn't kill anyone. But everyone else died, not to the, so, is this where he won and they started over again? Yeah, that's probably where he wanted to start over again. That's all the hearts, I think. Yep, yeah, actual hearts too. Damn. I just remember how scarring the last time I saw this guy's art was. Oh, he's beat up. Damn, in this kind of color, he looks really so damn how cool. How does it feel to have all of that power inside of you? Well, it's quite overwhelming, to be honest. What's going on? Still the sure power. about all this? You're not getting cold feet now, are you? What? I thought I could count on you. Are you doubting me? Yes. No, I, I never doubt you. I would. This is too. <laughs> the assimilation seems rather rough. <laughs> this 
Did he's I don't what the, I don't Ah yeah. I'm getting a lot of Akira vibes right now. The simulation seems rather low. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Him. As we but some. This isn't right. With this power, I can destroy the barrier. Oh, and yourself. Are you seeing this? Yes, Asgor. How does it look? Well, it looks like it's way too much for his body to handle. Ooh. Oh, that's so cool. These little techno effects highlighting it, pulling, or pulling it to the side. DT energy manifestation. Oh, it's literally determination energy. And you can see it manifesting by the outgrowth here. That's such a little cool overlay there. It will not be able to contain the rapidly increasing soul power. It could break loose any moment now. I don't know why, but I'm getting Ava vibes here, which is weird because that, that transformation right there, that flowy aspect is, uh, Way more Akira than anything, but I don't know. It's probably the orange screens and the overlay and the beeping sound effects. Yeah, that's probably what it is. He is in a very unstable condition. You think? Oh, what did that say on the screen? They actually put words on there. Let's see. Soul reaction. Organic plant biome identified. And oh, they can actually identify that. Sample A. Garden flower match 99%. So they've actually done that. They put so much actual detail in here. I love when people do this. Plant genome, 75%. Plant cell, 90%. Monster DNA, 10%. Monster cells, 50%. Foreign compounds, 25%. Unknown entities, 10%. Dude, I have no idea what that is. I'm assuming that's Loey's heart? It's kind of the same thing over there as there. Sorry. You have to come with me to the lab. Oh, something bad's about to happen. Your isn't life it? is in danger. <laughs> and live in isolation? Being a coward like you? Oh. This isn't the flowy ending, is it? This is a prologue, isn't it? Before he became flowy. Because this isn't Azrael freaking out about seeing his son alive, which would happen in Undertale because he was technically, I think, dead or considered dead. Ah. Well. Oh, this is definitely going to go bad. You want me to listen to you when you couldn't even protect your own table? Accidentally attacking or intentionally? Kara. Kara. You stay with me. You might want to stay there. Yes, Azriel. We'll be together forever. Until she doesn't want to. Azriel! I think you misunderstood, old geezer. What <laughs> did <that> happen? <laughs> oh, this is actually worse than anything else. Ah, oh, the noises make it worse. The noises make it worse. Yeah, it's even the arm. God damn, they're even doing the Akira pose with the cape. I just realized that. And that thing freaked me out so much. So I'm just getting PTSD freak out from seeing Akira when I was admittedly still in middle school and way too young. Ugh. Flowers, man. And now we get Flo's face. This is when it's first happening. Oh, it could withdraw. What? What? Two of them. And since no one stays with the credit, this video is based on a scene of the movie Akira. Called it! I called it! Also, in this one, Frisk and Kara are two different, so it's not actually, but it is actually. I don't even. What the hell is going on? 
to be concluded. I don't know the timeline on this, but it's damn beautiful, man. That's real. They even did it in the... Oh, my... I don't... Perfect god of hyper-death. And after that, admittedly, terrifying WTF counter that was actually a, a Kira reference. Hey, I actually read about that. What do you know? We're going to move on to Blundertail, the untrying, which I'm hoping is comedic because um, that last one was massively fucked up, man. I mean, dear God. Blundertail. I don't even have the style. Seer, the untrying. Human. Are you ready? Is that Pokemon music? Die. That. What? Let's just get this over with. <laughs> Is she just letting it happen? What's with the tutu? Actually, I'm not sure how come I was curing. Oh my god! <laughs> what the? All the freaking. What? What the hell? I thought it was on trying. Ah! No one can see this coming. Ah. What? Hey! Oh! <laughs> this is just a troll. It's a freaking audio troll. Wait, what? Cell phone? Hello, human. So I've been thinking. We should meet up with Undine and hang out sometime. He's shot like for food right now. Why is he drinking ketchup to think of, like, fish sticks? Oh my god. Is that a form of cannibalism? Several hot dogs later? What was with the derp dog and I don't even- I don't- And someone told me the Windings format is an in-game reference and they actually have meaning. So if anyone knows what that says, let me know. But also, what the hell am I watching? I just- Derp frisk. All my lead. Hey, Papyrus. You ready for one-on-one -on -one training? Oh, you bet I am. I brought a friend along. New friend, you You may know you. Hello. Uh, <laughs> the face. Hello, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the derp troll face. I don't even why is that. It's just. <laughs> That just broke me. And next up, we have the Megalovania animation. Now, before I knew anything about Undertale, which was admittedly until like maybe two weeks ago, I knew about this song because there's some amazing rock covers of it. So I'm actually really curious to see what, how this goes. And also, it's an excuse to hear a song I really like. So let's just jump into this one. I'm excited, man. Megalovania animation. Earth? And parody interpretations. Okay, butterfly. Ooh. Three years ago, once larger contract and studio project became a large part of my life, the project was no longer a priority. Oh, so this person's a professional animator then. Oh. And as time went on, motivation of the project why I didn't know dating became. There's no longer I have complete. My version of Megalovania will never be complete and shall be posted unfinished. I think it's about time I lay this project to rest. I hope you guys like my unfinished project. Thank you all for understanding and your patience and joy. Director Light AAA. If this is unfinished, I'm kind of curious to see what it would be like. Uh, mostly because I actually really like seeing unfinished stills. I don't know if that would be just the sketch phase or further on with line art. I don't know how far into the process they're talking, but I just like seeing the background before a finished animation comes up. So this is actually really cool to me because of that. Birds are a little surprising. Okay. I hear the talking sound in the background. Ooh. Unfinished, my ass. You don't even see any of the line work behind it. Edited, the good movement, the effects of the glowing. Oh, dude! <laughs> the smugness! Okay, I see how it's unfinished here. You haven't removed everything from behind it, but I don't care. If this is their unfinished work, man. They get the emotion right in the smug faces. That's the most important part. Dude. Oh, dude. Oh, I want to see that face again. 
that like right here it's all happy and peppy like here though it's bleeding there's eyes but they're smiling and their eyes all red that is the most fucked up thing ever oh <laughs> oh they're getting more deranged as they went dragon not a dragon someone said it was a gas capacity I guess he has a bone to pick with her. Ooh. Oh, the demented smile makes it even creepier. Oh, oh he actually looks like this. Ah! And he's getting more concerned about her, seeing how that goes. A hand? She's about to do something horrible. Papyrus, yeah. Oh, and this is definitely a genocide run. What? He's getting more frustrated now. But she's also getting more adept at fighting him. She's still smiling, but he's not as much. Oh, actual damage. His eye is going yellow and blue. Oh, God. Dude. Music is slowing. Showing he finally lost. Why is he bleeding? Why is the skeleton bleeding? Details looks good. Oh, and this is what the final one was gonna look like? Damn! I mean, don't get me wrong. I love exactly what they did, and I'd be fine if that was all they did, but this is a final one that's actually really well polished. Next up, we have Stop Running Away, an Undertale animatic. And if I'm right, oh, yeah, it's by Gail Rice again. I think I saw one of those earlier. Yep. So I like the animations. I'm kind of curious how they're going to do something. Or is this another music one? I have to find out. As long as you're green, green? you can't escape. What? Unless you learn to face then your head on. Oh, does the color of the heart indicate something in game? Ah, oh, also, that's a very unique or illustration for them. Cool. Is this a later one? Seven years ago? Holy crap. You won't last a second against me! <laughs> when I say face towards danger, I meant face towards the bullets. I think it's tired of your BS. Have you your spare to block the bullets with? Do I have to explain this any more clearly? Is this actually something happening in the game? Why are they doing? just standing there? Just face upwards! It's not hard! They're just letting themselves I, get hit? I wanted this to be a I, I thought if Fair I is unrated. This, it'll truly show how strong monsters can be. Nope. But, but now, We're going for Blargo on care. this. I, I'm not your freaking kindergarten teacher. That's it. Unless your kindergarten Why did... teacher. I'm not your freaking kindergarten teacher. Did they just... They finally figured out what's going on and got the hyper-expressive eyes. I don't know why, but for some reason I'm going Dio on this one. Oh my Unless god. your kindergarten teacher does this. <laughs> he finally figured out how to block. I was like the average kindergarten teacher, yeah. Like, all joking aside, if you've seen the shit that a kindergarten teacher has to literally dodge sometimes, maybe it's just the schools I was at, but when I was there and when I was just outside of it, and when I've heard stories from people who went into it afterwards, if God rest their souls, and I know where some of them are still alive. Yeah, no, dodging this kind of shit, and you yeah, know, no, that's pretty accurate. I see now what she meant. Yeah, they be the one throwing it in this instance, but details. <laughs> But I, I'm determined to, determined to end this right now, <laughs> right now. They've right learned how to block now. their posing. <laughs> They're actually getting smug. <laughs> die, 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 you're ready, you little brat. Where's he? What? I will never 
take mercy from the likes of you. Wait, wait. I didn't get the color. God. <laughs> <laughs> what? Escape from me for the last. Did time. it just redo the fight? <laughs> wait, wait. Gotta meet a sexy lizard. See ya. <laughs> Level noob. Just leaving wait, the wait, fight. Wait, come back here, the little punk. Oh, oh, <laughs> they actually. <laughs> I'm sorry, I love meta commentary wait, wait, and the fact that wait, she grabs wait, the wait, screen and then you can see her holding the screen and she breaks it. That is beautiful, man. <laughs> also, I think the animations look cleaner than the previous video I saw, so this one must be newer. And if this is how much they're... This is still a seven-year-old video. How good of an animator are they now? Damn, that's... I'm actually kind of curious. Just stop running away! No. <laughs> And last up today, we're going to be checking out Glitch Tales Season 1, Episode 1, Megalomaniac, or Maniac, reanimated by Jackie and Super Yoma Anniversary Special. And this is from ooh, Camilla Cuevas. Now, I've actually heard a few things about Glitch Tale, but those few things are that it exists and there's more. I don't really know anything else I'm getting into on this one, but if anyone knows, let me know because I'm very curious and I have no idea what I'm about to walk into here. But I can say that for literally every video so far. Which is actually kind of fun because all of this is freaking amazing, man. <laughs> oh, I really need to play this game, don't I? Yeah, yeah, I do. Reanimated version. Oh, so it's not even the. It's, of course, it's reanimated. They even said in the title, February 27th. Megaloman. Person who is obsessive, desire for power. So, CEO. Kind of generic. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. There, there was just a dialogue bit right there. What? And here is where the music starts. They actually put a freaking caption in for music starting. This has to be hand done, too. Where's this at? Kind of looks like the Sans fight throne rooms that I've seen so far. Oh, it is. Ooh. Listen to hear the Oh, they're actually doing the volume up. Oh, I'm going to turn this off if they have it already up here. So what is the sand fight again? Yeah. Do they have the voice actress on this? Witch Tale Anniversary? Solely orchestration? Oh, dear God. This is actually in-game stuff. Singer is Yui Sukit uh, Sukito? Damn. Very clear voice, too. Ooh, the shame on that. <laughs> Dude. This is the second time I've seen this fight, or fight animated. And this one is... Harder for Frisk, it seems. Or is it Kara? I can't tell which one's which. This is definitely doing all the different attempts. And they're corrupting too. Because he remembers that. And she remembers that. Because a genocide playthrough would come after a pacifist playthrough, right? The smile actually makes it creepier. The open eyes, too. Uh. Does that make a little thing back? It is this entire time. I didn't realize. And Sans just remembers blowing her up a ton of times. And because he had the memories of being a friend, that must be horrible. Continue or reset. Crying and smiling at the same time. Oh, that is fucked up. Showing them being taken over by the player character. Oh, Kara player character. I think people mentioned that. And... They're a completely different person. They're taller, too. Huh. 
they switch around. I'm getting more demented as it goes. Oh, yeah! When the skeleton looks less hideous. And you can see Frisk screaming from the inside. Oh, that is fucked up. Glimmer of hope? This is a series. Is something different here from regular tale? See, the thing they're doing right now with the audio, do you hear how the voice, not, the, not even the voice, but the voice and the music in the background are becoming more stretched out and they're slightly off key at pieces as he's slowing down? <sighs> and she's watching his sands. What? Oh, hello there. Breaking out of a genocide run? <laughs> what? Okay, this is different. Take my soul and I'll fix mistakes one last time. Ah. Fuzz? Wait, that imply he already had someone else's soul in there? You missing something, buddy? <laughs> he has memory and a reset. Mm. And Kara doesn't. But first... Dead! Reset this bitch. <laughs> it dunked on you, Michael Maniac. Happy Glitch Tail anniversary. What the hell is Glitch Tail? Is it like an alternate retelling? It has to be with how that went down. That was literally... Ah, oh, that was insane. Okay, let's just be completely honest here. I have no idea what's going on with that last one. It looks like it was Frisk pulling herself out of a genocide run and saying F you to car because hey, you can't reset now, bitch. Which admittedly is freaking cool. I just, I don't know. I'm just in sad fighting, getting tired and rising. He finally was like, I'm done and just accepting it. Then she just does all that bullshit. Just ah, what the hell is going on with that? What comes next? Where do I find more of this? I, sorry, this is actually freaking insane. The animations were amazing, and apparently that was the remastered version. So there's more. There, there's probably more. If it's season one, episode one, there's probably more. How much is there? What is that? I don't. How did I? Did, ah. I am standing on the edge of an ever-lapping abyss, and I do mean lapping because apparently the abyss is somehow showing out waves of water just to splash people, and when they get hit, they get drawn back in by the riptide of the current of Undertale. And frankly, this is really freaking awesome, so I'm swimming with the current at this point. Is it smart? Probably not. But I want to know what the hell is going on, so if anyone can tell me what the hell is Glitch Tail, where I can find more, what's going on, if there's a master playlist I can use. I appreciate that, because right now, I don't know nearly enough, apparently. Shocking. Me not knowing something. I know. Weird. So if you have, thanks for leaving the link down below, or, well, in the Discord. And I'll see you guys in the next one, whenever I do more of this giant pile of I don't have the slightest clue what I'm getting into. Actually, that can describe every video I've ever made, huh? Yeah, it really could. Eh, whatever. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for leaving a like, commenting, and subscribing. Because I know you definitely did that. Nice. And I'll see you guys then. Adios.